Hello YouTube, it's the uh, Brick Adjuster here with another episode of What of What? In today's episode we have a question from RF Bricks. RF Bricks asks, what do you think of a minifig wall? Will you make one? So you are probably talking about Steven from the Brick Show's minifig wall. If you ever watch one of Steven's Lego set reviews from the Brick Show, you will see his famous minifig wall where he displays his entire minifigure collection behind him. I think he uses a sticky tack to attach his minifigures to the wall. Well, at least I think he used to use that. In his videos, you could sometimes see little patches on the wall where the fig had fallen off, leaving the sticky tack in its place. I think he might have upgraded his system to attaching clear minifig plates instead. Will I do this? Probably not. I want to reserve all my available wall space I have for more shelving units to display more LEGO sets. Plus, I like to group my minifigures into scenes, and I can't do this if they are all together on a wall. I guess it would be easier to access the minifigures, which might be a good thing and a bad thing. A uh, good thing for me if I wanted to find a fig quickly, and a bad thing for me if the boys wanted to find one of my figs quickly. Actually, I don't know how easy it would be to find a minifigure if it was on a wall with a bunch of other minifigures. It might be like finding a needle in a haystack. So my question to you guys is, what do you think of a minifig wall? Will you make one? Comment below let me know. And please continue sending me Lego related questions. I love giving my thoughts. So this concludes another episode of What What What? This is the Brick Adjuster signing off. Thanks for watching and we will see you guys in another video. Bye.